everybody it's your girl big bad from creations by key and today i want to do something kind of fun i have some um strength plastic and we're going to try to make some gibbets for crocs okay so i already kind of have my images that i want i'm just going to say custom size i'm going to make it eight and a half by 11 okay so i'm going to go to upload i'm going to hit upload media and I just um, got some Hello Kitty images that I want to use. I'm going to turn these, take these over to my Cricut and make them stickers. So I'm going to upload them here. Um, and I'll show you why I'm bringing them here first. And I just thought this would be a cute little thing. I remember, I think all little girls kind of go through the Hello Kitty phase. I remember my daughter used to be obsessed with Hello Kitty. She was obsessed with Hello Kitty. Her whole room was Hello Kitty. Everything was Hello Kitty. And I'm an adult and I love Hello Kitty. So <laughs> I know little girls love it. Okay. So we're going to mess around with this for a little bit. Okay, um, and let's get her. All right, I think we have enough, enough of our images. Okay, all right, so we have enough, and now we're just gonna take our images and um, bring them all here. And when I get them over to Cricut, I'm gonna make them about three and a half inches, three and a half to four inches. Um, it's about the size that I want the Hello Kitties. I like this one right here with the little teddy bear. All right. So what I'm do to it over here is hit effects and take the background out here. I mean, I could do that in Cricut also. Um, but I would just rather do it like right while I'm here already. I have my images out. Oh, shoot. It's two of the same. <laughs> I didn't even realize that. So let's get rid of this one. Let's, um, yeah, we're going to get rid of that one. Okay. So we have our images here, our Hello Kitty images. Let's, let's get rid of this one and add a, a different one. So let's add one more. And we'll add them. Let's add her. I think she's cute. She's adorable. Isn't she cute? Okay. So I'm going to hit this um, effects again. Background remover. Okay. So now you guys know how to take the background out of your images on Canva. And um, you can do that with the pro version. Okay. So I have this set up like this and then also i want to um do something with the color don't um let me put a shadow on it shoot this phone is always ringing um Try. You can do all kinds of cool stuff to your images here in uh, Canva. Okay, but we're not going to do any of those. No, I don't want it to glow. I just want the image to stay regular. Okay, so I have my image here. Ba da 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 da. -da. Okay. All right, so now my image is saved and I'm going to get out of here and we're going to go to Cricut. Cricut Design Space, you cannot cut and print from the mobile version, but I just want to take them over there and get them together. That makes any kind of sense. Okay, so I'm going to upload. I'm going to select photo from library. 
And I'm going to take this. Okay. And what I'm going to do now is this. I'm going to hit remove because I want to remove the background. Oop. Remove the background. Okay. So I'm going to do that. And that's going to give me my little outlines for my Hello Kitties. Okay. <clears throat> Next. Print and cut. Hello Kitty. Hello Kitty. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and, and head over to the Cricut. And we're going to put an offset on these stickers. And then we're going to get them printed out on the shrink wrap. Okay, so now we have our four little Hello Kitties. And um, let's hold on, pause this for a sec. I think it's just okay. So, this is my favorite part right here. This is the cutting, <clears throat> the cutting part. So, the Cricut is just doing its thing. Um, I cut the shrink wrap and it cut through. I have the Cricut Maker, so I cut it on craft board. I put it on craft board and it cut it perfectly. I cut it perfectly. So this is my favorite part. I love watching it right. cut. It's something very satisfying about watching a cricket cut. Right. Yeah, so this is my favorite part here. Right. And the cricket is just doing its thing. Okay, and look, look at this. This is cool to watch too. See it shrinking. Right. So when it goes flat, you'll see it's gonna go flat. So right. when you take it out, what you wanna do is take a piece of paper and you hit it. You just hit it right there. When it and flatten it out if it's not completely flat. Right. And then I put some UV resin and I use my brush, okay, and a little glitter. And now I'm just going to hit them with the light. So the thing is, when you're messing with UV resin, you want to um, <clears throat> keep your regular lights off, okay, because you want it to cure pro properly. So I think I set my resin to 90 seconds and I'm just going to let it cure. I already cured the other side. And then after we cure them, those, we can connect them to the pieces and um, we can connect them to the gibbets and boom, you have crack, little cute little crack charms. Now they would have came out a little better. I put glitter on them because this is the clear paper, the clear um, strength paper, but get white. I would get white. So your colors are really, really pop. But yes, they came out so freaking adorable. I can't wait to show show y'all after it's finished. Okay. Okay, so now <clears throat> now what I'm doing, I'm just taking a little gibbets and I put a little dot of resin. A little dot of UV resin on each <clears throat> Hello Kitty. I'm going to push it down and then we're going to set it back under to cure again. Oh, 
I put the little gibbets on the back of the Hello Kitty with some more resin. And now they're just curing. We're just waiting. We're playing the waiting game right now, guys. And this is my first time doing this. So I think I'm going to let it go again for 90 seconds. Just to make sure everything's nice and cured. Okay. And this is a UV light. And the UV light and the UV resin, I purchased both of those from Amazon. Very affordable. Very affordable. And the, jib, the, um, the pieces, too. The little gibbet part. I got a whole case of them for about 6 to $7 on Amazon. And then I'll come back with the finished product. And here you have it. Cute little Hello Kitty crock gibbets that I made here at home. With um, the Strinky Dinks or the sh plastic shrinking, um, the shrink sheets. Very cute. The only thing I would do, um, they have, they come in clear and they come in white. I would definitely get white next time because I bought black pieces for the back. So I'm going to get white the next time and, and leave the glitter out. Or maybe just hit it lightly with the glitter. I, I went a little overboard. So I'm going to make some more and um, I'll show you how they come out. I'm going to try to find some white. I think I got some white paint here. So I'm going to try to find some white paint to paint the back of the paper white. But how adorable are they? They came out so cute. Oh my God. I love them. I love them. I love them. They came out so cute. So cute. Try it at home.